Hey, space explorers, ever looked up at the night sky and wondered about our planetary neighbors? Today, we're tackling a classic cosmic riddle. Why is Venus, the second planet from the sun, hotter than Mercury, the first? It sounds counterintuitive, right? You'd think the closer you are to the fire, the hotter you get. But in the grand arena of our solar system, things are a little more complex and a lot more fascinating. Let's start with Mercury. It's the speedster of our solar system, zipping around the sun in just 88 days. Being so close, its surface temperature during the day can skyrocket to a scorching 800 degrees Fahrenheit, or about 430 degrees Celsius. That's hot enough to melt lead. But here's the catch. Mercury has virtually no atmosphere. It's just a barren, rocky world. So, when night falls, all that heat radiates straight back out into space. The temperature plummets to a bone-chilling minus 290 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 180 degrees Celsius. That's a wild temperature swing. Mercury gets incredibly hot, but it just can't hold on to its heat. Now, let's journey over to Venus. Often called Earth's twin because of its similar size and mass, Venus is anything but hospitable. Its secret to being the hottest planet lies in its atmosphere. Venus is shrouded in a thick, toxic blanket of carbon dioxide and clouds of sulfuric acid. This atmosphere is about 90 times denser than Earth's. Think of it like the ultimate greenhouse. Sunlight passes through the clouds and heats up the planet's surface. But when that heat tries to escape, the super-dense atmosphere traps it. This phenomenon is called a runaway greenhouse effect. The heat just keeps building up with nowhere to go. This turns Venus into a planetary oven with a constant searing surface temperature of around 900 degrees Fahrenheit or 475 degrees Celsius. That's hotter than Mercury's daytime high, and it stays that hot all the time, day and night, from the poles to the equator. It is so hot that spacecraft that have landed there have only survived for a couple of hours before being crushed and cooked. So, the mystery is solved. While Mercury gets a more intense blast of direct sunlight, it can't keep the heat. Venus, on the other hand, with its thick, insulating blanket of an atmosphere, traps the sun's energy and roasts itself into becoming the hottest planet in our solar system. It's a powerful reminder of how crucial an atmosphere is to a planet's climate. Isn't that incredible? The solar system is full of these amazing puzzles. If you enjoyed this cosmic journey, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more adventures into the universe. Thanks for watching, and keep looking up.